What's good, YouTube? This your man, Spill Dog. Man, I just got through watching a video a little while ago on Fight Hub uh, with Sean Porter uh, talking about the fight with Hossein Rockman and Jake Paul. And I saw Rockman have an interview about it too. And uh, I man, it sounded like I don't know if you ought to take this fight, man. Uh, I think they, I think Sean said something about it. It's a, 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 a 210 pound weight clause, then another 10 pound dehydration clause. Uh, are they fighting heavyweight or what? I mean, uh, who is these dudes? What the hell are they doing? Making up new rules in boxing? Uh, I'm going to say this right here. Hey, 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 Rockman. That's, it sounds like the overlay for the underplay to me. Uh, if you, you know, if, if he got all them clauses in there, uh, and, and, and if you, if you think you can't deal with it, don't take this fight. All money ain't good money. And I'm going to say this, that dude ain't putting all these, uh, clauses in his contract for nothing. And he been he been beating he been beating these motherfuckers up out here. So uh, I you know from what I hear y'all done sparred before, so he'd have been in the ring with you before, so he know a little something about you. And then and if he gonna uh make you make you sweat down and lose a gang of weight, then don't let you after the way in go in there and eat and get back right, dog. Uh, this is the overlay for the underplay. This is this it's like a sucker's bet. It's like a sucker's bet to be man. Uh, now. By by Big Rock Mom being there, I would like to think it's not one because I, I I would like I would like to think that he wouldn't let no, let his son go for nothing like that. But then again, he a grown man now. Uh, I like I like the Rock Moms, period. You know, uh, I was more of a fan of their father than anybody else. I, you know, because he more around my age. But all I'm saying is this, uh, Rock Mom, if you take the fight, if you take the fight. Then you can't bring this shit up no more. If you gonna fight them, then don't nobody wanna hear all this shit about the contract rehab. It's just not even don't, cause you don't have to do this. It ain't no gun in your head making you take the fight. You know, uh, you ain't. And I, don't, I don't know if you got a promoter saying take this fight or I won't put you in the ring no more. It doesn't sound like you just uh, maybe want the money. You know, it ain't nothing wrong with that. I straight up ain't. Uh, but. If, if you go in there and this boy beat you, you can't bring all this shit up. You just can't. Don't nobody want to hear it because you don't have to do it. Understand that, you know. Uh, I mean, do not let no more. This is your game, dog. You don't let nobody play you in your game. You know, they meddling in the game. They ain't came to the amateur. They didn't go and come up like y'all did. And I'm not saying that because I do like the pause. I ain't got nothing against them. I'm saying that to rock my, don't be no sucker. And let nobody play you in your game. That's all I'm saying. You know, uh, they this is happen chance to them. You grew up wanting to be a fighter, from what I hear. You know, uh, you grew up in a fighting family. You know, you've been around this shit all your life. So if anybody gonna be do, pulling in a sucker contract, that's supposed to be you doing it. You don't, don't don't let nobody play you in your in your in your sport. And sound to me like. Uh, it's a lot of bullshit in that contract. I wouldn't, I, I wouldn't fight like that. Either he wanna fight you or he don't. Uh, and if he can't fight you straight up, it's like you said, you had one hand to spar, and but y'all going back and forth about it. Well, you not know, let that go, dog, unless you just like arguing and, and, and making excuses, because that's all it's gonna be. If God, if, if, if God forbid, you go in there and lose. Now, and I, 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 I have to agree with Jake Paul on that because when you talk about all this stuff, it do kind of seem like getting an excuse ready before the, before the fight starts. You know, uh, my thing is this. If you uncomfortable with any terms in that contract, turn the damn fight down and then let him come back when he, when, when he got nuts enough to fight you straight up or, or just leave it alone. Because if you get in that ring, you can't come back out here with all this it ain't gonna mean nothing to nobody but you. At the end of the day, you, then it's going. It's even worse because of your father and you've been in this game pretty much your whole life. You are gonna let somebody come in here and, 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 and hit you with the okie doke? That is gonna be a hundred percent, a thousand percent on you, and, and, and there shouldn't be no sympathy. There shouldn't be no sympathy. So I ain't rock my guy. Mad respect for you and your family, but it sounds like sometimes you gotta just pass. I don't know how much money it is. I don't know how good the money look to you, but if the money that good, then just take the money. And if an ass whooping come with it, you're going to have to own it. But all this talking about the weight and all that you and Sean do, y'all got to stop that shit right now because you don't 
have to take this fight. That's just that's what I'm saying right there. Uh, you know, uh, that, that's 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 that, that's bush league, dog. I mean, you bigger than that, rock mind. You ain't got to. You know, it's okay to turn the fight down and let them see if they want to say. I'd rather for them to talk shit about me not fighting and going in there getting beat beat up with all this with a bunch of crap and a contract that put me at a disadvantage. But that's it for me on this video. If you like the video, hit the like and subscribe to the next time it's your boy Spiel, dog. I'm out.